let's calculate the limit when x approaches 0 of sine of x divided by x. We see we have a quotient of a trigonometric function, sine of x, and a polynomial, x. Both are continuous in the set of real numbers. So the quotient will be also a continuous function in its domain. To calculate this limit, let's substitute the x by 0, and if we obtain a value, that will be the result. Sine of 0 divided by 0. That's 0 divided by 0. And this is not a value, it doesn't make any sense at all. This is not possible. We can just write them when we are calculating limits. They are called indeterminations. An indetermination means that if we obtain, a, like in this case, a zero divided by zero, this is not the result of the limit. To solve this limit, we are going to use L'Hopital's rule. When we have a zero divided by zero in determination in a quotient of functions, the functions are derivable. So, the limit can be written as the quotient of the derivative of each function. So, the numerator would be the derivative of the sine of x and the denominator the derivative of x. This is the limit when x approaches 0 of cosine of x divided by 1. This is the limit when x approaches 0 of cosine of x. Now, let's try again to substitute x and see if we don't obtain an indetermination. So we have the cosine of 0. That's 1. And this is the result of the limit we were asked to solve. 